The Children's Hour by Henry Wadsworth Longfellow Read for LibriVox.org by Jerry Dixon October 8, 2008 Between the dark and the daylight, when the night is beginning to lower, comes a pause in the day's occupations that is known as the children's hour. I hear in the chamber above me the patter of little feet, the sound of a door that is opened, and voices soft and sweet. From my study I see in the lamplight, descending the broad hall stair, Grave Alice, and laughing Allegra, and Edith with golden hair. A whisper, and then a silence, yet I know by their merry eyes, They are plotting and planning together, to take me by surprise. A sudden rush from the stairway, a sudden raid from the hall, But three doors left unguarded, they enter my castle wall. They climb up into my turret, or the arms and back of my chair. If I try to escape, they surround me. They seem to be everywhere. They almost devour me with kisses, their arms about me entwine, till I think of the Bishop of Bingen and his mouse tower on the Rhine. Do you think, old blue-eyed banditti, because you have scaled the wall, such an old mustache as I am is not a match for you all? I have you fast in my fortress, and will not let you depart, but put you down into the dungeon, in the round tower of my heart. And there I will keep you forever, yes, forever and a day, till the walls shall crumble to ruin, and moulder in dust away. End of poem. This recording is in the public domain.